All right, the old elimination method, solving systems of equations. So when you're doing this, you're always adding. And so what I mean is you're going to either add the equations or you're going to add linear combinations of the equations. So you're allowed to multiply the equations, then add them, but it's always adding. So in this case, I can just add the equations and if I see that, I add like terms, I get negative x plus 3x is 2x. Negative 4y plus 4y cancels out, hence the elimination method, because it eliminated that term. Negative 22 plus 2 is negative 20. So x equals negative 10. Plug it back into either one. We'll go with the bottom one. So we got negative 30 plus 4y equals 2. Add 30 to both sides. 4y equals so 30, 32. So y equals 8. There's our answer. And of course, we can plug those back in. Uh, so if I had negative, negative 10 minus 4 times 8, that equals 10 minus 32 equals negative 22. And it'll work if I plug it into the other one as well. All right, well, that one was super easy. How about the next one? This one, you gotta do a little bit more. If I add the terms, nothing cancels out. So I can't just add them yet. I have to multiply. Now you can multiply one of the equations or both of them, depending on your situation. In this case, I gotta multiply both of the equations. Um, so I think the easiest thing to do would be to multiply to get rid of the y's. Well, actually they're smaller numbers, so I can multiply to get rid of the y's or the uh, 10 and 3 are already opposites, so I can multiply by them. Let's go with that. Let's eliminate the x's first, I guess. So I'm going to multiply by 3 here. That's going to give me a 30x minus 15y equals 75. Now the main thing is I'm getting a 30x, and then when I multiply this by 10, I'm getting a negative 30x. So that's the key idea here. That's um, why I multiplied by what I did. And then I got to distribute that to everything. Got negative 20y equals negative 40. Now I'm always adding, remember? <coughs> Excuse me. And those eliminate. I got negative 35y equals 75 minus 40 is uh, 35. Y equals negative 1. Sweet. Plug that in. I get negative 3x minus 2 times negative 1 equals negative 4. Negative 3x plus 2 equals negative 4. Negative 3x equals negative 6. Subtraction 2 from both sides. x equals dose. So y equals negative 1. x equals 2. Plug them back into either equation. It'll work. But did it right.